You just finished work or school and you just want to relax with some good old Apex Legends. Maybe even get one of those sweet victories. <laughs> that would be nice, right? <laughs> well, screw you, motherfucker. Service down. Just like that, your plans for the evening are ruined because EA decided to give the hamster running their service a little break. Now normally you would be doomed to sit around and do nothing, but not today. Because I have prepared an exclusive guide of things you can do that makes you feel like you're playing Apex Legends even though the servers are down. This first tip is short and sweet. Go to your kitchen, boil some water and make a nice cup of coffee. Once the coffee is done, take it outside in the good weather and find a good place to sit. Now. As you're sitting there, relaxing, having a good time with your coffee, take your cup and throw it straight in your face. Congratulations! You have now simulated the feeling of starting a match only to find a P2020 and die straight away. <laughs> you're welcome! It is no secret that Apex Legends is inspired by a certain popular shooter with a dedicated fan base and a top-notch movement system. I am of course talking about Legends of Craft, the original game that is totally not a Chinese ripoff. Come on guys! You can really see where Respawn got their inspiration from. You can play as Rambo, you can play as a football guy, you can even play as the original caustic, the original ladies and gentlemen. The graphics might not be up to industry standards, but all the classic weapons are there. I mean, you got the P2020, you got the Spitfire, you even got the Kraber for those epic, epic wins. So what are you waiting for? Download this game straight away. Um, okay, why can't I hit, why can't I hit anything in this shit game? Reading Apex Legend fanfiction is a great way to really feel like you're in the game with just your own imagination. Uh, let, let me give you an example. <clears throat> so Revenant is set in before the games, trying to find answers as well as finding himself, dealing with his new injury. Okay, so that's when Revenant, he turned into a robot. Uh -huh. uh, and of course, trying to familiarize himself with new feelings for his body. He jacks it. Okay, so uh, maybe that was a bad example. Uh, let's try another one. You're the new and upcoming Apex Legend, referred to as Huntress. Okay, cool. Uh, you find yourself in a strange love affair with Bloodhound. Uh, <laughs> okay, guys, uh, I'm sorry. Let's let's try another one. Bloodhound breeds you with a strap on out in the middle of the forest. Uh, guys, I changed my mind. Don't fucking read Apex Legend fanfic for the love of God. <laughs> If you can't play Apex, then why not just bring Apex with you to another game? Just find a game where you can customize your characters and BAM! Just like that, you can play any character you want. <laughs> you won't even feel a difference. And the first thing we see is a dwarf bard playing the funeral meme song. Um, just like Apex, guys. Just like Apex. Now, in the end, we all know that we are playing Apex Legends to open those sweet loot ticks. So, why not just play a game where you do that all the time? <laughs> With the Apex crate opener, every day is like the start of a new season. I mean, loot is just falling from the sky. You just need to click and click some more and click again. But then when you have clicked, you can go over here and click and open a loot tick. And then you go back and you click again and you click and you click some more, and then you click again, um, and you click again. Uh. Actually guys, this fucking sucks, throw this guy in the trash, EA, fix your fucking servers, you have no excuse, I mean, hamsters are so cheap, you could easily buy more of them to run your servers, what are you doing?